we're back with more Kayla 15 action here at Evo 2022 in beautiful Las Vegas, Nevada. Aru and I have been blessed to see some pretty exciting matches so far in the day. And, dude, it just feels like we're just getting started. It really, I mean, we basically are because uh, we've got a long day of KOF ahead of us. Um, this is really just the start of it. We're going all the way down to the top eight. Uh, by the mm -hmm. end of the night, we're going to know who we're going to be seeing in the arena tomorrow. Oh, yeah, but oh, 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 my God, here we go. Yeah, so, I mean, you guys can see it on the screen. We've got, um, you know, Taiwan's own E.T. on the screen, a former EVO champion. That's right, 2017, uh, that's KOF right. 14. Going up against uh, Yurikov from New Jersey, playing uh, Bijene. Long and Meitenkun. Yeah, and you know, Yuri called on social media earlier saying, you know, feeling pretty good about his chances to make top eight possible. Oh, yeah? That's good. I mean, I don't know I... if he said it himself, but I hear people saying, like, you know, he uh, he's one of the favorites. I'm excited to see him play because I don't think he's ever really had a chance to go up against ET. No, yeah, I mean, he says here that it's the, it's his first time playing against ET. So uh, we're going to see uh, probably uh, what what he's made out of here, you know? Oh, most certainly. You know, I've played this guy plenty. i played both of them. Yeah. And it's just, you know, both very good at what they do. Yeah, absolutely. So, uh, you know, Yurikov on player two side, it looks like. Yes. Yeah, Bijane on point for Yurikov and Kula on point for ET. And nice reversal there. Catch him. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Goes right over the sweep attempt. E.T. has that sixth sense. Oh, my goodness. The spacing was immaculate. Almost oh, certainly. E.T. playing most likely the, the strongest team in Kayla 15. Sands no rock. Oh. All right. I like it. So Yudikov just working his way back in. Oh, tried um, to shatter strike that. Okay. Yeah. Had it been the heavy version, it would have worked, unfortunately. Oh, nice. Goes the anti-air. Hey. Wow. Great awareness. And it gets opened up low. E.T. looking pretty textbook. I don't know. There's not much to say about it, you know? Well, E.T. will definitely uh, pull out the stops when he needs to. Mm -hmm. But otherwise, yeah, he's going to be pretty straightforward. And it's on Yudikov to make him get a little creative. That was a great punish on the landing recovery there mm -hmm. into the knockdown here. Let's see what we got. And this is looking like easy money for E.T. Oh, big nice. stance, E.D. Okay. I like it. Yurikov, uh, not, you know, he's not playing afraid or anything. He's just playing his normal game. Yep, there is a game plan, especially with Luong, the Stan City being one of the cornerstones of that. I'm surprised that that connected, but yeah, let's let's go. Yurikov, uh, evening it up right now. It's like, thank God it hits twice, right? Yeah, right? <laughs> Plenty of time to hit confirm with that one. Uh, probably was looking for a wake-up throw, but got lucky in instead there. Pookery things, apparently. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, no. Stood up, went for the throw tech. And now E.T. Oh, oh, he drops the combo. <laughs> oh, no. Wow, he's going. He's really insistent on that throw. That's one of the things about uh, Yurikov, I noticed, is that he likes to condition you on the throw very early on. Oh, good tech. Good tech, yeah. Dude, Another that's like tech, literally geez. four or five throw techs now in one round. All right, not enough to kill, I believe. I think it is. Oh, not quite. Doesn't use the EX meter either. Not a lot of defense on uh, Luong's side, so we saw she kind of just had to take that. Yeah, unfortunate for Yurikov. That was a very difficult situation to fight out of, and now we've got Yurikov. I think this is kind of his best character. I think it's the strongest character, too, and the fact that he's on anchor really hammers at home. Uh -huh. A lot of times I'll see Yurikov run him on point, but I think for ET, he wants the best for last. Nice. And ET not respecting this character who just has the strongest, like, soft, like neutral play. Yeah, I mean, it's, equation right now. It, I always say when I'm on commentary and I see this character, you don't ever want to jump at him, but E.T. is proving me wrong. And I think the reason he's not afraid to do that is because he's so ahead, you know? So it's yeah, just he's got like, a secondary, and he's still got an anchor coming in. And he's like, if you're going to spend meter to get rid of my secondary, I'm not worried about it. Exactly, yeah. And now we, we see Yurikov now has no meter going up against E.T.'s three-and-a-half bar Cronin. Who that is also so... also can't jump on. <laughs> exactly. So dangerous now. Oh, my God. And now Yudikov has to work. Ooh, oh, what was a, a challenge! Beautiful, beautiful whiff punish there. And this is gonna hurt. Nice! That was a great option from ET. Putting on the pressure with that fireball from far away so that it kind of eliminates a lot of potential defensive options that Yurikov could have thrown. Yeah, and Yurikov kind of cracking there because he was like, I don't want to block the fireball, so let's just EX pillar, I mm -hmm. guess, you know? All right, Yurikov, though. Looking, you know, he's not looking too shook or anything. He's not like, uh, he's, he's looking fine. He's looking fine. Ready, go. I'll say that was pretty close. Yeah, you know, he, he made it a good match. Yeah. 
I think some small adjustments here. Yudikov could probably take this uh, this game right now. Yeah, I agree. Anything can happen, man. Got the oh nice. Open him up low. Et went for the throw. I think because Yurikov established Ooh. that he goes for throws so often, Et was you know caught standing. You see Yurikov catching him with the jump too, with the uh, the tatsu. Oh, nice man, of tatsus. Yeah, that's the Yurikov. Uh, he's he's a little sloppy with his jumps right now, and I feel like he's getting punished a lot because of it. Oh my god, dude, this is rough. Yudikov still with the resources to turn this around. Nice throw. Beautiful. Got to make this work, though. Got to make it count. And you ET telling him, like, nope. Oh, my gosh. Wow. Anything can happen No still? text. Wow! Wow! Farsi. Yo, Farsi, Janae. No EX. No EXs, though. Those no! Were Those were it. That was the round. He threw it away. If he had optimized just a little bit more, like you said, man, that would have been it. Two chances, too. ET gave him two yeah, chances. Dude. He's like, bro, you're not going to EX. Bro, I can't <laughs> believe what I'm seeing. But it's okay. I mean, Yurikov, uh, he's, that was just the first character. Gets the throw. This is a very threatening mix-up. Yes. I'm glad to see everybody gets hit by that. <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I got hit by that so many times by this same guy, dude. Oh, my God. Nice. I like that. That was a really good guard cancel back into the corner. And E.T. wasn't ready for it and got thrown. And E.T.'s gotten thrown at least three or four times. Yeah. Uncontested. That's the one thing about Yurikov, though, is he goes for so many throws, more than almost any other player that I've seen. Nice shatter strike. Beautiful, beautiful wow. stuff. Wow. And it falls, falls up with one hit, when one hit, unfortunately. Didn't spend any meter on it. What the heck? What a cross-up. Nice jump, uh, CD. Ooh, beautiful. Yurikov pulling ahead here. This is looking convincing. Yes. Gets the hard knockdown here. Okay, goes for the standing low, but that time ET blocks and challenges appropriately. Simple combo, good damage though. I feel like ET's getting a little shook right now. Oh my oh, goodness, another that's one. That's gonna be it, I think. Oh, just a little bit left. What's Close. next? Oh, just the chip takes it, Hell Pockets. Oh my god. Yo, Yurikov, let's go. The adjustment is real, bro. <laughs> mm -hmm. And now we got Yurikov long up against Cronin right now. Cronin does have five bars, or four bars. The down C snuffs out that stand CD, though. He's going to spend all of it. Yes. All right. Yeah, why not? I don't blame him, man. If I'm ET right now, I'm like, I don't know what this chick does. I got to get her out of here. Sure, sure. ET now. Uh, Cronin against Maytenko. I don't really see this uh, matchup that often. We only saw it like, yeah, really. This is pretty much the only time I have seen it. Oh, wow. Okay, wake up throw. And I think this is where the biggest adjustment needs to occur for a duty call. Dude, he's just not scared at all to jump or hop at this Mayfan Kun right now. Oh my god, he's spinning on a guard cancel? Oh, that could be curtains. That's yeah, that's very uh tough situation now. Oh my gosh, the spacing. Play neutral with me. Oh, oh the dead. safe jump! Damn bro, he got so close with one more super. He's got Get another chance. No, yes. Got the bar from it too. Oh my gosh, that was so clean. Waited oh. for it, reacted. My dude said draw. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> Quick draw, McGraw, ET. Good stuff. So ET moving on. Uh, but man, Yurikov made him work for it. You oh know? yeah, he definitely made him sweat just a little bit. I would say that that long and that Bijane yeah. will be something that ET remembers. Of, of course, yeah. That's what I'm saying. We got ET. Hailing from Taiwan versus Sace MX from Mexico. Oh, <laughs> you gotta be careful with the man with the slick back hair. He's ready to, he's ready to put on demon time, baby. Oh, <laughs> going goblin mode. Here we go. Yeah, goblin mode. <laughs> but no, wait. Hold on, hold on. We're forgetting about ET, the king of goblin mode. Oh my God, dude, that is like literally goblin mode personified. If you've seen Evil 2017 and his top eight run, hell, yeah. his grand finals. And all the way through versus Shaohai, you will see that this man went through like several stages of emotional <laughs> distraught and grief. I'm, I'm surprised he just doesn't grow horns right in front of us. <laughs> it's just like, yo, I'm going to win this. Oh, dude. But at the same time, like he, he, they would be disappearing and then reappearing again because I think that guy just cracks and then readjusts himself immediately at least five times a match. Yeah, he has a total meltdown. His like internal <laughs> age has got to be like 78 right Oh, I'm now. telling you, dude. <laughs> oh, man. It's like ET currently the reigning defending EVO KOF champion. Yeah, I'm excited for this one. This is, again, man, we're getting that great opportunity for a player like Sace to really put themselves on the map here against a great player. We're going to be able to play this back in the archive. It's, it's going to be difficult, though, man, because one thing about E.T. is, yes, he's the best, but 
He also plays weird characters at the most inopportune times for you. We'll see, man. I mean, uh, he's had a pretty standard run so far, though. Yeah, pre pretty standard characters too. But if he, if, uh, whatever reason, I think he goes down a game. I think we might see some uh, some magic. Yeah, I'm really curious to see what Sage does with this Chizuru because Chizuru is nuts, man. It's like a, it's like a little bit of a jigsaw puzzle in the neutral. You know, you don't know when to respect and when to disrespect. And mm -hmm. you know, again, you're going against somebody who is a historian like ET. And he should technically be ready. We're giving the benefit of the doubt that he's going to uh, be ready we for the matchup. We kind of have to, you know. Yeah. Like, he is definitely uh, at the top of the pile right now. Oh, baby. A Kula mirror in the snow stage. All right. I love these guys. These guys are about the lore, baby. See what you did there. We get the Kula buff. Nice oh. jump in here from ET. Damn, that projectile has a lot of recovery. Quick draw, McGraw, Kula. Beat her to the punch. E.T. looking to take out this imposter. Ooh, instant overhead. How dare you visit me on this stage? This is my home. Coming to my house on the Sabbath? <laughs> exactly. I'm trying to eat, man. I got, <laughs> I got a family. Can't you see that there in the background? That's my cousin. This is my venison. <laughs> we don't eat those here. <laughs> say, say, Max, like, yo, I eat whatever I want. Can't you see I'm a hungry boy? He said, why does it matter? It's made out of ice cubes anyway. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Looks like it's doesn't taste delicious, but I eat what I see. Yes. You put it on a plate, you serve it up to me, and I'm going to chew it up. Says MX moves up. Taking out the point cool on ET's side. Great start for Says MX. Ooh, and what? A full jump in what? here. Scored right out the gate. And ET got caught trying to be cute. Wow, wake up. Oh, we'll no, see. All got, right. got being cute again. Not finishing the combo. E.T. not looking that great right now. Uh, uh, Ari almost the losing stun? the secondary. Yeah. Oh, oh. Wow. <laughs> Let me get out of there, bro. Yeah, right. No parts check, of that wanted. Check, please. Oh, and you're right back into the game. Uh, the manager caught you trying to dine and dance, and you're going to have to pay this toll. You got to wash the dishes, brother. <laughs> no, nah, bro. I'm about to engage. <laughs> Goblin mode. <laughs> the horns are growing on E.T. He's still got a GPG day on life support, though, man. That health is not coming back. We are still in threat level orange. <laughs> E.T. definitely doesn't have health insurance here, so he's got to be able to finish off say, some X. This guy's over here trying to lift 50 pounds, and he ain't got no health insurance. My god, what a risky individual. <laughs> and of all the characters in the roster, Chizuru definitely knows, looks like she knows how to operate. Oh, most certainly, man. She's definitely snitching on people at work, getting people fired. The surgical precision that she can provide in the gameplay. Far D, too nasty. Not sanitized, might get infected. These big buttons, though, what do you do about that? What do you do about it? You block. You, not go, interested, you go to urgent care and the doctor says you're fine and you go back home with some aspirin. Nurse, she's either doing the opposite of do no harm. Oh my oh God. Oh my God. Wow. Stace and Mech getting busy. Here we go. Overhead hits. You see that pressure right there? Whoa, oh, what a challenge from ET. Yikes. Gets in for some pressure overhead. Starting the mix up situation. Gets. Some offense going, and Sace and Mech shuts it down just as he's getting started. And that's all you need is a cheese to play, just one stance seated to hit, and all the momentum is back in your favor. Yeah, is it going to burn it? Doesn't need to. All oh right. Oh, my Ooh, God. This is healthy. Yeah. I mean, ET's got a healthy Cronin here with three meters. Sace and Mech's two. This is not. It could be worse for ET is all I'm saying. It could be worse. It's still doable, but at the same time, Sace and Mech's not does not have the burden to make it happen. He can hang back. He can w watch, wait for ET to make a mistake. Oh, that boy, may not happen, dude. though. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Oh, even no. it up? Yes, he even got pulled ahead. Damn, what a bank for your buck. But Is now, say some X, say some X. Oh, no, no level three? No level three? Oh, my God. That's not dead, but that's very close. What, what? are you doing? OK, he's not going to be able to get the punish off of that. Oh! 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 Sace MX, bro, another one in the chamber, ready to explode. And you got that right, baby. Two for one special at the bar. It's happy hour. It's not goblin mode. It's not demon time. Damn, man. Whipped out the heater and put down the kid. The crowd lost it. Losing their minds. Oh, my God. You think this is wild? Wait until later on tonight and then tomorrow. It's going to be bonkers. Right back into it again with the Kula Mirror. Says MX on the board. Got one in. All right, ET is not happy about that guarantee. I mean, who would be? Close match goes down. 
to you just getting hit with the bullets. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, that was quite an unstable match. It felt like it got a little crazy on that last uh, round there. Uh, Demon time versus goblin mode, bro. I'm telling yeah, you. Versus happy hour, bro. Two for one special. <laughs> You're going to get an oil change for 150, 20% discount. Oh, my God, dude. And right now, E.T. still at the life deficit already at threat level orange. He's got to find a way to get out of the situation. Eats a wake-up throw. Uncharacteristic of the man. Got to be careful. Okay. Wow, run up to be the classic. You got to love to see it. Kula players are definitely eating too, man. Doing it for themselves, are they? Kula. Whoa, oh, basic. Oh, big bet. One of the few characters that can run up and be far enough with that far beat to uh, cancel into something with the punish. She's great, man. <laughs> All right, E.T. up ahead. I gotta say, I thought I would see a character switch on on uh, E.T. side here, but I guess he thought he almost had it. What a conversion, Sace and Max. Stop the momentum, reel it back in in his direction. This crowd feeling it, bro. Yeah, definitely getting the crowd buff here. Crowd buff is very important. Get that momentum on your side, crowds on your side. They obviously don't know that this is a three-hour block. They need to hold it down. <laughs> they need to relax. <laughs> oh, don't try to challenge. All right, smart move. I can tell that Hell Pockets got hit with that a little too many times. Yeah, <laughs> I definitely got some PTSD from that. <laughs> definitely. Some patience here, surprisingly, from ET. Looking for an opportunity, but Sason Max has been there to challenge every single time. What a control from full distance, man. Who else gets to do that? I don't know, man. But at the same time, he's got to be careful sticking oh. those clones out. The big wink Get and it, level dude, three. Dude, he does not want Chizuru on the screen at all. Oh, dude, she's going to take her shoe off. How can she slap? I said my child needs more than just aspirin. <laughs> my child is sick. Let I'm, me in. You know what she said at the end? She's like, oops, I'm just a Sagittarius. Sorry. Do you know who John Q is? Don't make me do what that man did. <laughs> The cool, the, the Cronin though, four bars, possibly, possibly could take out this ET brand Bijanay without spending all the resources and still have the resources lead if he gets another significant touch. It affords the opportunity for ET to get a little nutty on his approach because of this lead. This is going to do good damage. Most certainly. And you see that ET is just going to try to whittle down his health. Even if he loses the Bijanay, he's going to come into the, the anchor battle. Oh, no, man. Oh, this is the champ, though. Whoa, this jump back gets an overhead. God darn it. All right, man. OK. Gosh darn it. ET with the classic deep exhale. Jeez. We've seen him done it a bunch of times. And I don't know what that means, man. Is he engaged? Was that what was that quite, you know, demon mode, goblin mode? Well, right. well, he, he's kind of going into like, you know, uh, awakening I have, stage. I have mode. He, I am now uh, in extended. god mode. I see the future, and I will eat your children. Mike Tyson <laughs> is my favorite fighter of all time. <laughs> what? We didn't ask for that info, ET, but thank you. He wrote it down on that thing right there. So. Oh, yeah. Actually, yeah, that was actually what he wrote. ET, <laughs> Mike Tyson is number my, one, man. my favorite athlete. Yeah. <laughs> You see E.T. right now, oh, holding him up in the corner. Somebody call the police. Nice response from Stacey Max, though. Gets out of the corner, but man, all that health whittled down so quickly. Nice. Wow, runs into another one, bro. Face first into a 2B into EX race spin. Now we're going to see a lot of 2Bs up in here from Kula because literally the best button she has. Why does that work? Why does her chill in there? Oh, right, it doesn't that was, matter. That was cheeky. You can't, yeah. Okay, E.T. E.T., you don't like that. As I said before, I've learned how to relax my breathing into the next <laughs> level. Oh, he used the real one. She actually ran forward. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually me. I'm here. <laughs> Imagine bringing friends with Chizuru, bro. L listen, is this you? Or am I talking to the I mirror? Like, come uh, on. I don't even, you know what? I don't even want to deal with you. Yeah, just no, I'm actually here. <laughs> nobody cares. Pay the tab and get out. I said nobody cares. Eat this 2B into EX race spin. ET is starting to run away with it. Ooh, the T the back. Woo! That movement put uh, Sason X out of the corner and put ET right back into a dangerous situation. Just wake up race spin, though. Hey, what are we doing here? Hey, man, it, it, it clears over Every, like the 2Bs. It goes under. It goes over a bunch of stuff. It's like a low crusher Tatsu. Exactly. What? Et won so many of those exchanges. 
Uh, he he lost must, the war. Lost he, the war, though. He must be feeling pretty damn good there. Yeah. Well, you know, look at this. Uh, Dijonet in secondary has been absolutely shutting down the Chizuru. But he has had a lot of success so far. I, I still think as long as he's able to commit some damage here, it's not going to be that bad. And it gives him all the... Uh, well, all right. I don't Let's know, see. man. No, man. He's ascended, apparently. Two bars for Cronin, two on the anchor side. I don't know. Not yeah, looking great here for Sason Mex. Sason Mex has said, cool facts about you. Mexican power. Going to have to summon it from the crowd. Whoa! And there it is. Right on point. Right as we reveal what is cool about you. And I tell you right now, if he gets rid of this... Bijane with some healthy health meter. This crowd's gonna explode. Much like the damage that Oni oh, can in. Oh no. Great positioning here for ET. And you see right there, it's ET was sniffing oh, out those is, lows. This is definitely goblin mode right here. Oh, he's, yeah. he's getting crazy. Nice. He's feeling himself. My boy's seeing into the matrix. He got plugged in, bro. He's not gonna get prematurely jacked out. Extremely for extreme foresight. That's all I'm saying. Connect the cable. I'm going back in. <laughs> I love the steak. It tastes delicious. <laughs> uh oh, oh stop, here stop. we go. Samson Max plugged back in as well. You gotta be careful. That far she's gonna oh, unplug you. Wow. All right. Et takes it over. Samson Max. What a great performance there from both players. Samson Max still in the tournament. Let's out a big exhale. Now it's gonna get serious. For Sace MX. Let's see how that run looks like after this. Loses this, run. Is, this is a face from ET we've seen many times. That dude looks exhausted like 24 7, man. He's <laughs> like, God, why do I keep doing this to myself? Give this man some Sunny D. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's got electrolytes. I don't know. He needs the energy now, not from the Earth's people, but from the bottling company. I'm not a nutrition. I don't know how that works, man. And speaking of how nutrition works, maybe some of these ads will help you out with your health. <laughs> We're gonna go into an ad break, folks. Stay tuned. We got a bunch of action still left for you. We'll be right back.